hello friends welcome back to my channel so today we are back on uh, another Splunk tutorial so this is will be a very short uh, video where uh, you know I've been getting a lot of queries on uh, Splunk learnings and Splunk certification so in this tutorial we are going to talk about uh, what are the ways we can learn Splunk so you know in my uh, channel there are a lot of Splunk videos where you can go through it you can find out how to set up Splunk on Linux uh, CentOS machine you can also see how we can set up on Windows uh, you can configure your forward how to get your data into Splunk create your dashboard charts so a lot of apps we have used so all those information are there but still you know uh, there are some Splunk uh, official site which we can make use of it and there are some trainings which are available for free and uh, there are some good training uh, videos and also if you are looking for a Splunk certification uh, we will also see where you can find those information which you are looking for and as a bonus why I started this video now is because uh, I was able to also find there is an offer from Splunk where you can get uh, your certification for uh, $50 so there is a coupon code which we can make use of it and you will be able to do your certification in Splunk so I will be sharing that detail also in this tutorial so all those reference link I will uh, link it to the uh, uh, video description so before I start I would uh, request you to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done yet and uh, like the video share and comment so all of you uh, would have known this site like splunk.com where we can create you know an account where we used to download our Splunk installation so when we install Splunk we have to log into the Splunk and we have to download the installation source right so uh, this website it's the same website but you have to go to the location for trainings so if you go to the trainings you can see uh, on the left panel you can see the trainings and uh, certification section so there are there is a section for free courses so if you go to the free courses there is a free Splunk fundamentals one so if you click on that it will give you the complete uh, course description so this is a very good training for somebody who is very new to Splunk and who is a Splunk user who want to see how you can make use of a Splunk to make some queries we can make some dashboard so if you see it's uh, give you the complete detail like how to do basic searches fields fundamentals the different kind of commands creating report dashboard lookups so this is a very good uh, training to start with so this is uh, directly from Splunk and I have also completed this and uh, fundamentals one and there is also one for fundamentals too but which is uh, you have to pay for it but some of the companies I think they have some tie up and if you have your own organization have some tie up with Splunk maybe you can do it for uh, free as well okay and there are other trainings as well like Splunk infrastructure overview and uh, some other user behavior analytics and fundamental series so there are some free fund uh, Splunk trainings which we can definitely make use of it so you we can definitely see you know the tutorials from YouTube's you know channels which will give you a lot of uh, their uh, learning experience the way how they do it uh, which is also good but these things these are from directly from Splunk and these are some free trainings you can definitely register for it using a Splunk uh, account so don't uh, wait for it just create an account in splunk.com and uh, make use of uh, these trainings to start with okay and uh, you can also go to this learning path so if you want to know what kind of trainings I have to do because every certification for training there are some pre-requests so we will go to the certification part but before that uh, you can go through this uh, learning path as well now just for a sample if you are a course for a user you can see you have to complete Splunk fundamentals one two three creating dashboard so these are some kind of trainings some of them are free some of them are you have to pay for it okay and uh, like administrator what you can do it uh, so you can go through all these things so I'm not going to go through each and each and every learning path this I just want to share you the location where you can go through it so I will link this uh, uh, location in the YouTube uh, video description so you can just go to the link from the video description you can go through 
uh, all these things so there is also a section for videos so you can get some of the videos uh, we can you can go through it so like uh, Splunk cloud tutorial so these are some tutorial from uh, Splunk education itself so you can make use of that so this one uh, we already spoke Splunk fundamentals so now let's let me just go to the Splunk certification section so I will link this uh, PDF in the video description so you can go to this and this give you the complete overview of what kind of certification is available in Splunk okay so if you see the Splunk have a different kind of certification one is the Splunk uh, core user uh, certified so it's a user based and there is a next level for it's called power user and there is a, another one called advanced power user so all these three things are a user based certification if you want to go for an administration then you have to go for Splunk certified admin and from the certified admin you can get into the developer and also then you can go to an advanced stage which is called the Splunk certified architect and then also there is something called consultant and there are some uh, ad hoc uh, certification like uh, enterprise security intelligence and uh, uh, phantom so these are the main certifications available in Splunk so to categorize them you know these are beginner to advanced level as I said the, the power user is the basic competence for user and the admin then uh, architect and consultant so uh, if this PDF has complete details it has even uh, classified what is the uh, roles or what kind of training is applicable for what kind of users so if you see this is for non administration roles so all these three is, uh, is for uh, uh, like user trainings like certification so this is a, a Splunk user certification this is a power user this is advanced power user but these are for a non-administrative role but if you are going for an, uh, an add-on role this is uh, the highest level and, uh, and how we can do the certification so the the certification always have some prerequests as I said you know you will have to do some of the trainings some of the other certification you may need to do and then you have to register in a Splunk uh, a site and you have to get an ID from them then you have to register in Pearson view then you have to complete the certification you can uh, block it uh, as a you know as a going to the location of Pearson view to do the exam or you can also do the through online so there is an option now available through online where you can uh, do it through online as well so the complete details is available in this uh, link so you can go through it so I will link this one as well into the uh, uh, video description I'm really hoping that uh, some of you are uh, really want to get certified in Splunk so you can make use of this learning path how you want to do it so just uh, make use of this uh, uh, details from Splunk itself and there's another uh, handbook uh, for Splunk certification so this one also I will link it this one also talks about uh, the certification what kind of certification and uh, what it actually does and the complete detail how we can uh, register for a certification what is the pre-request you know how you can register in Pearson view and uh, the cost for a certification is uh, $125 per exam but if you are doing for uh, five certification you can do it for uh, 500 dollars so that's the actual cost of the certification but as i said uh, in today's tutorial i was able to find the splunk is giving an offer where you can uh, do the certification for 50 dollars per uh, no, for one certification so let's go to that one so this is a promotion from splunk okay so i'm not giving any promotion from my end or any coupon code this is directly from Splunk and I was able to see it uh, in the Splunk site okay, so I want to share with you as well so if you see this offer is from August 1st till August 31st so we still have today is uh, 22nd of August so we have another two more months September and October so if you want to make use of it you can uh, make use of this offer okay so it says you know all eligible candidates can register for one certification exam for fifty dollar so it's it's applicable only for one certification okay so how to do it itself that is also it's given and there is a code 
uh, when you apply for the certification it's called 30 up buttercup so if you use this uh, coupon code you will be able to get the discount from 125 to 50 dollar so uh, the complete details is uh, given here okay so for exam you know which you want to select you can select it from uh, this one but always remember you know if you want to do splunk admin probably you have some pre-requests like uh, power user it has to be completed so you have to look for those pre-requests whether you have already done that okay so that is the uh, reason why i brought this uh, video so just want to share this uh, short information how we can make use of uh, this offer and also how we can uh, get into splunk certification and uh, get on to the your splunk role okay so definitely i'll be also continuing to upload some of my experience on splunk and learning so you can make use of those videos as well okay so i hope this uh, short information is informative for you and uh, thank you for watching i would uh, request you to subscribe to this channel like the video share and comment